Hello viewers, welcome back to my garage garage. However you like to say it is your way. But we are here at the side of the turbo. I didn't actually show you properly uh, how I've actually redone it. Because if I remember correctly, the original had a black engine. But this engine is the same color as the bodywork. I have turned the grill white, the bumpers white, frame accessories. Same spoiler though. And it's black. So that is back to its former glory now. I have gone ahead and bought a trailer ready for when I need to pick up equipment and I have gone ahead and bought a, a car trailer which I probably won't be using but it's something that we had before the game got absolutely annihilated and my save got corrupted. So today's episode what am I going to do? Well, I need to go to the junkyard first. Because I don't fancy buying a used car. Because it's going to have mostly everything done to it. As in, I only need to do a couple of things and that's it. Hey, it's a car and I'm fixing it up to five star. Because it's already practically a five star car as it is. Whereas the junkyard, they're wrecks. They need your handiwork. So, how much are you? Not bad. Of course... It doesn't really matter because everything will be replaced anyway. And as I said in the previous episode, the sledgehammer will be going to work. Or is it hammer time? Or is it sledging time? I don't know which, but it will be uh, used on junkyard cars only. I damage the vehicles. That's it. No coming back from that. Unless I do... Hmm. Hmm. Wait a sec. I've just remembered something. Go to the garage. Where's my... Oh, right. Wasn't the turbo a lad coupe? But this turbo is a lad. Huh. And, ah, my phone going off and I didn't mean it to, so do apologize. So, do I redo the ladder coop and make it a, a turbo? Or do I stick to what I said before? I get a car and I have to put every single engine in it. And I do believe this one is the i4, which is a 1.5 engine. And in this one, it is an i4 still, but it's a 1.8 engine in it. So I need a lad to be a turbo lad. No, 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 no. Not a turbo. Uh, supercharger. That's it. A supercharger lad. Or a V8 lad. So, hey, that sounds very tempting, but 
I think I'll uh, leave it for now. And I'll set my eyes on this Chad here. I know there was a car here. Is, was this a Chad? Yes, it is a Chad. Cheaper. But does it need more bodywork doing to it? This one has literally no wheels. It has good interior. I need to find the interior shop. I really do. That is blue though, and this is red. You know what? I'll go for the blue because we've got white, we've got red and original. So let's go ahead, buy this one. And that looks being good nick, so I'll leave it there because I'll just buy stuff from the book from now on. And there we go. Nice uh, V8 engine block there. And for the bar, okay. Awesome. So, let's go ahead, send you home, there we go, and off we go, there we go, woohoo! Alright, let's go ahead and clean, clean, why aren't this car moving? Okay. The handbrake didn't even move. Probably not. Huh. Okay then. So it's definitely not moving. Normally. Oh. It moved that way. It moved that way. But it's not moving back. Okay then. Fair dues. Let's go ahead. Wash it down. This is actually a nice colour. Wow. Let's go. The back is done. There we go. Boot looks nice. Bumpers look alright as well. A lot of rust, but that can be easily fixed. Go. Fantastic. This looks absolutely beautiful. A lot of rust there. Doors. Go. And for this car, I think the lowest engine is going to go into this car. I would like to actually see how the cars act with the different engines and of course differentials and that's the main reason why I'm actually doing this there was originally I have to have each car at a five star point but now I have to have each car at the five star point with different engine parts in it so there's the 1.5 1.8 supercharger turbo v8 so i'm going to have five cars of each brand so five lads, five lad coupe, five barts, five chads, five nivs. Yeah. And when I'm actually uh, looking at, or shall I say, listening to the video, when I'm editing this, I'll be like thinking to myself, you know what, I've just made this ten times harder for myself. And... Did I name all the cars that are in the game? Or did I miss a couple? I have no clue. 
Alright, go. So we'll go to the magazine to make sure. So we will have, yeah, five lads, five lad coops, five chads, five nibs, five barks. And they will be uh, mixed with convertible or hard tops, as in they've got a roof. Or is convertibles classed as soft tops? But this car looks like it is now clean. Apart from, obviously, the jagged areas. So, let's go ahead and fix that up. So, basically, the sledgehammer will make broken parts damaged parts to then be allowed to have the hammer work on them to be repaired parts oh i've missed this side but yeah that actually looks to be uh, all good so i just need the hammer there we go nice piece of kit that is let me get the hose wash you down we have got one wheel tire as well. When I say wheel, I mean uh, rim or the whole thing. Go with this actually being just damaged. I can still clean it. There we go. Hammer. Yeah. Rump. Make it all fine again. Any more? Yep, that grill needs to be sorted. I think that is it. No, still got some uh, work to do here. Wow, that's a lot of work. Oh, there you go. All done. And open up. And I might actually still replace this uh, support. Okay. I can't get rid of them cracky lines. Now, let me see. Even though... It is kind of repaired. Can I actually get rid of them cracks? No. So it must be the inner panels. So that means I need a wrench. So how is uh, everybody uh, doing? Hopefully everyone's doing it fine and you're having a good day let's loosen that up and you up get the panel off and i think i will get rid of the grill as well so that can go over there our way and I need to look here for some more bolts. Here we are. On there. On there. And I need to get view. Go. It's out of there. You are out of there as well. And I am left with. Not much really, but we should be able to actually fix this up nicely. So I need the screwdriver. I will work it to uh, grinding and buffing everything out. I just need to get rid of the parts what don't necessarily need to be on at the moment. Go. 
scroll can go over there. And then I will rid of the bumper so I can actually clean it better. And repair it if necessary. Are you bolted on? I can't remember. You're bolted or welded. It's bolted. Get it? So that can come off. Go. Them parts are okay. I need you off. I need grinder. And I need grinder disc. Go. And here we go. Now I can actually get all the pieces off this car nicely. So these three, and then three here, and I can get to work on this bit in the panel. Go fine. You're okay there. You're not okay, so I can get rid of you a lot. And sorry to you. I think I need to get the box out. So I don't have to take one piece at a time. And I need a disc again. I may sure bring it out the whole box. Go. And this should allow me to get rid of the whole inner panel. Should do. Might need to go inside a bit. Ah, there it is. There. Uh, that should be that. Hmm. Why haven't you come off? Oh, wait. There. Yep, there you go. So this is left front panel. Oh, I need the battery holder. Go. And that is that bolt and that bolt. Go. And now you can go. And I need to get this onto wheels. So let's get the inner panel. And it is a Chad body. And I need left front panel. Go. And I need you opening and you need to get the welder as well. But hopefully this will tick a box for the one point five engine Chad and at the end of it all once I've uh, completed all the cars necessary I'll do a race of sorts to see which engine is the best for which car And still got some disc left. 
I need that one going. I can't remember. Was there any more? And the box is here. Nearly used up the box as well. Don't need that. Sure, there was a piece down here somewhere. There it is. And then one underneath. I think. That. Oh, there's one there. And one there. Car is shaking. So it must be doing something right. I think. There we go. That should be it. Yep. It is. Oh, thank you. Get you out of the way. And I need the wrench because this interior is definitely broken. Oh, keep forgetting about that. Let the panel fall out on its own accord. Or you'll probably damage and wreck the car even more. Because the door will just slam. Okay. Have I done any damage to it? No. Nope. Oh, hello. Why are you like this then? Okay. Seems like everything's fine now. Okay, wrong. Okay, where is the damage then? That actually... Oh, that's broken. Okay, then. It's fine. I need to wash the door. Go. And... I need to fix this. Up as well. If I can get it back onto the car. I need to get rid of rust and then I need to paint it. Go. I think I need to repair it as well. Go. That looks to be good. Off from that bit there. Okay. So. I need to clean. Here. And I can't get to it. Okay then. Frustrating. But, yeah, there you go. Can't clean it. Can I get rid of the mark? I'm sure. Ah, there you go. There. So, obviously, that... Bondo! That's why I haven't used yet on the Chad. Only used the hammers and the uh, sledgehammer. There we go. It's actually working. Need to find all the parts. 
of the panel that need fixing and then I can actually repaint it and move on. So there there Where is the part? Come on. Now I'm confused. I thought this actually fixes stuff. Oh, there you go. Is that nope, still got some left in there. That's fine. Go. And let's go ahead. See if anywhere else needs Bondo. Yep, it does. So yep. Confirmed, I've still got some body filler in there. Now, let's go and get the cutter. Brilliant. Go. Now, let's paint the panel. Wow. Love this colour. Awesome. We go. Make sure I get every single part of this. I don't have to come back to it. And same again, I can't seem to paint that in a bit. Which makes it very awkward. And that be that. Now that can go back on. And now let's tighten it up. There we go. Something still is off though. Does not look right at all. Really doesn't look alright. Oh, and I uh, actually should have mentioned this at the beginning of the episode, not halfway through. I am actually recording these videos not just specific to my garage. All my videos that I am doing at the current stage are all bulk videos. Because I am actually going away and I would like to have videos Occurring whilst I'm actually away on holiday. So don't worry, there will be uploads. I will be able to reply to comments whilst I'm actually away on my mobile so I can use the uh, studio app. I can actually reply to comments. There we go. So currently what will be bulked will be my garage, farming simulator 22, mom bazoo, but not straight away because I'm actually hoping to get the second part of the up the recent update. But if not, I'll just continue uh, with the first part of the uh, update. Because the recent update for Mom Bazoo is coming to us in a few stages. We've already had the first stage. The second stage, I'm hoping to 
put content out on. So it gives me more content rather than just doing like two videos and that's it, the update is done and over with. There's no more content, so I have to put all my fingers until the second part is uh, actually here. This way, with not doing content on it, I'm actually giving me a chance to show you more content and have more videos on the game rather than just going hey here's the update this is what's happening there you go Mombazu is gone until whenever it updated or I deem fit to have enough content on I believe is everything for that so for one of the weeks of bulk recording there is two my garages and and I hope to have this as a full episode but I don't know because obviously I'm trying to jam pack everything in Believe that is everything. There, done. Go. What is left? The back. How's the front? Do you like that? Then go get the hammer and check this out that's fine now I can actually place you onto the car again there we go one two three and that is that back on now this Yes, it is dirty. Okay, let's get this cleaned. Go. And there's no rust on it. Does it need Bondo? Yes, it does. And that is now empty, so I need to get another one. And then I need to respray that. So, thank you. And off I go. I really do like this colour. I actually do like red, but not on its own. I normally do like red if it's mixed in with other colours. There is colours what I do like and like on their own. But red, I don't know. To me, it looks better if it has other colours around it. Luckily, this car will actually have that. There's obviously black tyres and it will have... Oh, that's gone. The interior colour as well. If I have to drive that to the interior shop, I will do. But I'll take a trailer. If I can bring loads of uh, pieces of interior back with me. There we go. Turn the mouse wheel actually get a better angle with the paint and hey a presto there we go nice looking car I reckon I actually do like uh, all the cars for this game to be honest and I think 
possibly the first one of my really do like is the Niv, then the Bart, then the Chad. They're my uh, top three cars for this uh, game. Now let's go ahead and get real note the bumper. Where's the hammer? There. It's fine. Yeah, get the bumper first. Go and then wrench. Go and there we go. And now it's time for the grill. There we are. Screwdriver, tighten it up there. There. Go. Looking good, looking good. So I need the right panel now. Body. That is right front quarter panel. And let's get this painted quickly. Where's paint? There it is. It's done. And then this part. Try to get some of that bit done. And I do mean try. Is difficult to do. I've got to admit, the panels on the Chad actually quite difficult to work with when you're uh, painting and cleaning it. Go. And I need to get the trim as well. That one. That one, that one, and then I need to get the battery holder. Go. And I need to also fix this bit. Go. Looking good, looking good. So I need trim for the right side okay where would that be still body no Ooh, got a charger uh, grill nice mod there yeah has to be accessories um Yep, there you go. Front left, I need rear right and front right. Go. Don't know which one I picked up. So let's hope it'll be. Nope. There we go. I knew it was that one straight away. Ah. Hit me. Ready? Now. Just trim. And let's go there. And then let me pump. Pump up this tire. And hey presto, looking good for now. Damn it. And unfortunately, this is going to be the end of the episode. So thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the episode. And please remember that at the moment these recordings are bulk, but I will be replying to your comments down below. Thank you again. Hopefully you'll see me 
in the next one.